You know, they say breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Well, here's a recipe that gets you started with some fresh flavors delivered in a fresh way. Community Regional Senior Executive Chef shares his spin on a smoothie. Hi, I'm Senior Executive Chef Andy Hatcher at Community Regional Medical Center. Today we're going to make a smoothie, but not so traditional. We're going to serve it in this bowl. We have various berries, granola, coconut, some pumpkin seeds, and then up here we have coconut water, Greek yogurt, and some frozen fruit. So to start off with this beautiful smoothie, what we're going to do is we're going to create what I call a base. Uh, our base today, just to show you how versatile this is, we are going to start with about half a cup of coconut water in our blender. And then for today, I'm going to show you this versatile thing here. The superfood kale, we're going to put that in there. This is really gross if you eat it by itself, but in a smoothie and we put a bunch of fruit in it, it's excellent. This kale, and if you were to use spinach, is extremely tough. So if you don't grind that first, uh, your smoothie will be very uh, fibrous. So the next step in creating our base is adding all of our frozen uh, fruits or vegetables, whatever you want to put in there. So we'll add all that in there. And then we'll add a half cup of yogurt. That was one full banana that I froze and one full mango that I froze. You can also buy that at the store uh, in the freezer aisle, already done for you. Um, now we'll blend this up. So how you check the viscosity of this is I like to tilt it and see how it's kind of runny still. So what I'll do is I'll just add a little bit of ice to that to kind of thicken it up some. If you add too much ice, the uh, blender will not blend and you won't incorporate everything. That is ready to go in our vessel here. We are going to put our delicious mixture in. I like to put just a little bit in first. And then what we'll do is we'll add some of this granola in the bottom there. Kind of creating kind of layers. So put a little bit more in there. Just like that. Look at that color. Then what we'll do is we'll start putting all of our berries in here. And you know the sky's the limit when it comes to the different ingredients you can put in this guy. And there you have it. This is very versatile. Anything that's in your refrigerator, any fruit, slice it up, put it in there. Granola. Um, you can even put more yogurt in here. Uh, you know, the sky's the limit. Any, I just created the base for you. Anything you want to put in that base is how you want to make it. Wow, does that look delicious. Well, you can watch Midwatch today on KC24 Saturday nights at 7. The program is in partnership with Community Medical Centers. And speaking of healthy, we're going to